Hey guys, today we are taking a look at the MetaQuest 2 VR goggles. I had the ones, so, and they were awesome, so today I'm really excited. So let's get it open. All right, as you can see, it's pretty simple. You got your two handheld devices, and on each one it's gonna have the different controllers, and the throttle on the front, and the trigger on the side. All, each one for different games. It's gonna come with the goggles. I think you'd, you'd attach this if you were in glasses to give it a little bit more space. The C charger, it's a C to a C. So it comes with a silicone cover you can put onto the goggles. And if you're outside, never put this up or it'll burn, the sunlight will burn a hole in the lenses. So there is a way to adjust the diopters. Let's get it charged up. Let's check it out. I'm excited. <laughs> All right, guys, so I can say the version two is way more immersive than version one. When you first try version one, it blows you away, but this thing brings it to a new level. It just is crystal clear. One thing I like about this one too, is when you start, you kind of draw a line around where you're gonna be at. And even if your dog comes into that area, it will tell you that an object has came into your, into your playing area. And when you're playing the game, you're inside the game and there's like a magical wall. And if you stick your head outside of that wall, then you see what's outside of the game. And it lets you know that you're, you've went outside of the game. So that's kind of crazy. One thing too, when you buy this, it's kind of like buying a Sony PlayStation, you have to buy the games. So when you buy this, you've got to spend a lot of money buying all the different apps. Some of them, they can find them on sale as low as $10, but I'd say the average one's 20 to $30 per app. So realize once you buy this, you're gonna to to spend more money to, to be immersive, but there's bowling, there's golf, there's all kinds of travel ones where you can go into cities and walk up and down the, um, where you can walk up and down the streets and you can look around at the monuments and go over waterfalls and that's when you see people falling and getting scared and it's just, you can go hunting, you can, there's all kinds of shooting games, there's all different kinds of attachments you can get for this. So I think it's a great value when you buy this, but the apps are expensive, so you just know you're gonna have to spend more money. So if you're thinking about getting one of these for your kids for Christmas or something like that, that th this is a great, great thing to, um, I know it's still a video game, but at least they're up off the couch and they're having fun. So enjoy.